the autumn I told you that popcorn was magic, reached into a pocket and pulled out a handful, stuffed it in my face with full eye contact, you never called me back. Corn, kernel, a kernel of knowledge, on the counter encountering kernels, overcoming hurdles. On top of the onion we heat up a pan, some coconut oil from faraway lands, the molecules moving and start to expand, with a shake of a hand, friction, chicken. A kernel like an egg the size of a drop underneath an inferno that's getting real hot once that spark is ignited, you know it can't stop, unless you turn it off. It's been 20 seconds since you filled it up, you might feel the urge to just stop and give up, you lazy f Pressure, I'm four feet from my dresser, four minutes away from textured mouth pleasure. That oil sizzles hot and it stings like a bitch, like a pin in your finger instead of the stitch, one of your best friends in bed with the one you were with or a very small rock in your shoe at the tip, with miles to go and nowhere to sit. If I only had Velcro, I'd give it a zip, a holster with nothing to shoot from the hip, when the bottle lands sideways while trying to flip, an entire dry breadstick with nothing to dip, a kink in your knee when you're trying to skip. Pain hurts. Lid, a glass ceiling, a container of motion, held stiff with my fist, can't stop this commotion, we're not making popcorn, we're making a potion to heal the world, or for snacking purposes. Exploding, like an idea, also like popcorn because it actually is that. What started as kernels expanding so full, we put that expansion inside of a bowl, an above ground hole. Salt from the sea, smoked paprika, then wang jang gul. Then grab it by the fistful, transport it to your face hole, fill it like you're shoving love inside the gap inside your soul. Soon you'll be full with your head full of clouds, delicious small crispiness cracking out loud. Uncle Mark looking down. I need to wash my ceiling. Not exactly proud. Two cars with only a one-door garage, is popcorn real or just a mirage? Reality. Beneath that hard shell of armor that makes us so tough, there's light fluffy softness and unspoken thoughts. Unless you're a bit of a blatherer. You might have said everything already. Probs TMI. Because sometimes life is tough. You're past the point of having had enough. The tears start to fall like you're leaking your soul. Your chest starts to swell in your guts, there's a hole. Brace for the shock and let it roll through you. Then reach for the popcorn. Open up, let it soothe you. But as you get to the bottom of that bowl, take those unpopped kernels and lift with a feather, then keep them in a special place forever. Because popcorn will always have your back. Popcorn will never give you flack. Popcorn will never borrow $5 and not pay it back. Popcorn will never borrow your car, get into a fender bender, then say it was already like that when it brings it back. So never be afraid to pop. Corn. Also, we need to save the ocean.